Look at all those leaves and stuff in the water. It's muddy, backwash looking. Let's go check the crab trap. Still that one lone crab right here. Toss it back out. Not too many crabs back here in this little part of the river, but that's okay. Back at it again out here behind the cabin. Got a shrimp down there. Let's see if we can get anything. Now we just wait. Don't get too many bites during the day. All right, this one's been out there for about 10 minutes. Let's see if it even has any bait left. Good to know, good to know. Lots of turtles right here. I can see three turtles over there. The camera might not be able to, but one back behind the tree, one under the tree, one over there to the left of the tree. I think I see like a gar or something over there. I'm not sure if I could catch the gar. All right, let's go see if I got something. Got one, let's see what it is. It's, it's a gar. Get it over here and off the hook. That's a good size gar. I don't want this guy to bite me, so I'm just gonna come over here and get the pliers. Let's see what this hook is doing. It's facing down in his bottom jaw. So I'm gonna grab it and twist it upwards as soon as I get a chance where I think he's not gonna snap at me when he's doing all that. Okay, you done yet? Here we go, almost. All right, don't bite me. Okay, okay. There we go. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. I don't want him to bite me. There we go. Nice one. Good looking gar. Alright, let's see what I got that awesome gar on. Got that sliding bass sinker. A split shot to hold it there. 
this hook right here wore some of that copper color off of there. Strong mouth on that thing, sharp teeth. Let's get a new shrimp on here after we retie the lines frayed right here. All right, we're gonna just thread that shrimp on here again. Peel off a little bit around the hook. That's how I set it up right there. Very easy sliding rig. So if the fish takes it for a second, you don't feel that weight. I'm just so happy I got one. Good size fish, let's keep trying. Watching from the balcony. So far I got one gar, that's pretty fun. Check out how low the water level is. When the tide goes out, all of that muck and stuff over there is exposed. I can see a giant log in the water. I can see some paper trash floating by. Let's see if I can catch something tonight. Well, I hear a lot of ducks over there, that's for sure. And a bat just hit my line. Fish. What do I got? Hello. This is a little croaker. I'm gonna use him as bait. This is perfect. Let me go get my heavy duty pole. Got the eight footer now. I'm gonna use that croaker as bait. We'll see if I can get something big tonight. Let's take a look at this little croaker here. Good bait size croaker here. We got about a five incher. There we go. Here's our bait. Got a big old kale hook on there. Five inch croaker. We're gonna toss him out and wait. Here we go. So this one I'll do a little bit of this and that because it's got a croaker on there as bait. But if it goes over, whammo, then I know I got something good. Let's check that drag. Alrighty, let's get that little one out here again, see if I can get some more croakers. Got one. All right, let's see what we got here. Good little fighter. Another croaker. Take a look at them. This one's a little bit bigger. All right, let's let him go. I'll come back and check these in a little while. 